Ruiz is uh, coming up on its 25th year. Uh, it started back in the late 80s on Bloor Street, actually, at Bloor and Bathurst across the street from Honest Ed's. It was, it was a family-run business then, and it's a family-run business today. It was a much smaller space. The main floor was 24 hours, um, and the basement was actually the venue, a very small, dingy, dark basement. Yeah, a lot of people don't know that because we've been in this location for over 20 years now. A lot of bands really broke out after having played here. Uh, like Broken Social Scene played here really early on. Cancer Bats had some good shows here early on before they had their more success. I mean, Arcade Fire famously uh, shouted out Sneaky D's at the Junos because Toron like in Toronto this was their first show. There's been a lot of things that have come through here. Holy fuck, fucked up. Like, bands with swear words. Uh, <laughs> We've become a very prominent part of the community and the city at large. Like a lot of people that haven't even been to Toronto recognize us or the logo or they know that certain bands have played here. I don't know, like it's, I mean, people often tell me that we're an institution. I guess we are now, we're coming up on 25 years, but really it all sort of happened by accident. It was just sort of like hard work, dedication to what we were doing and consistently putting out like good food and you know serving cheap beer and all the stuff that makes young people happy it's weird a long time ago somebody told me that if you picked up the lonely planet under toronto if you want to see the real toronto you got to go to sneaky d's because it's such a cross section of the city typically like we're youth oriented let's say but i don't even want to say that really because it's like a, a lot of families come here a lot of people that have been coming here for 20 years bring their families now a lot of people met here and got married and keep coming back. We've had weddings here, man, because of either we cater their wedding or they've had like their reception here and stuff because it means so much to them. Like it's a really cool thing for us anyways to be like a part of people's lives.